Marquis de Lafayette was a French aristocrat and military officer who quickly became one of the central figures of the Revolutionary War. He played a crucial part in the final battle of the war, known as the Siege of Yorktown, by blocking any possible escape of the British by land. This led to the eventual surrender by Lord Cornwallis, which assured victory and success to the American cause. 43 years after the war ended, Marquis de Lafayette returned back to America in what's now known as Lafayette's Tour. And one organization is traveling up and down the eastern part of the United States to highlight the stops he made along the way. So this is a nonprofit that was created in 2019 uh, with the mission to celebrate the farewell tour of Lafayette when he returned in 1824 and 1825. So one of the stops he made was in Yorktown to mark the 43rd anniversary of the siege here. The trail stretches across 25 states. So it goes all the way from Maine to Louisiana. And to this day, we have donated over 92 markers across 18 of the 25 that he visited. It's been an amazing journey. We get to meet a lot of people. and We get to see how Americans are enthusiastic about Lafayette. And, you know, almost 200 years later. To me, the significance is that People acknowledge and recognize Lafayette's potential as a figure of early American history to unite. I think that's the key that I would emphasize because that's a message I bring forth all over the country, the ability to unite. And in a place like Yorktown that has so much significance for uh, 1781 and the Allied victory here, to talk about Yorktown with Lafayette 43 years later, uh, that to me draws a crowd for sure. But then around the country, there are also a variety of things, like Lafayette was an abolitionist, he was a friend of the Native Americans, he believed that the United States was a force of good and that um, it would be basically the creation of a, a government in North America would help to increase the human condition around the world. So that's why he joined the American Revolution. And so I'm French, so when I say, when I tell that message to Americans today, uh, I think it, it resonates quite well. And what's fascinating to me is that it resonates with the same intensity in all of these states. Because they are very, I mean, we're in Virginia here, but in Maine, in New Hampshire, I'm telling you, in Louisiana, they all have the same excitement about Lafayette. So those markers, what you saw here, it's the same all over the country. So that's what I like about it. I like that there is this trail that stretches across the entire country at the time, right? And people come uh, together and celebrate Lafayette and the Revolutionary War. That's fantastic.